Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas, I'm your host, and I'm here rolling solo dolo on this Madden 20 Browns franchise rebuild. Here we are, folks. We are in between seasons four and five. Uh, we had a serious Madden punch to the gut that knocked us out of the playoffs. Go watch the divisional game. You'll see what happened. It's definitely uh, great. So we lost a lot of players. We're rebuilding, as always. We're always rebuilding. Uh, so what I'm going to do first here is I'm, I already went through the free agents, and I offered a few contracts. Uh, it's not a very interesting thing to go through all this. So uh, really, I haven't really done I tried to offer a just for a cornerback, a backup running back, and a left end. This guy actually, like I have Nick Chubb. And I had to franchise him a second time because I can't I can't get him to offer up on a contract. But I've had an epiphany. I am just going to pay the man what he wants. I might try to mess with his contract a little bit. But we'll see. So um, I did put uh, ODB on the trade block because this is last year. He's made a ton of money. He's old. I could probably get something for him. And I put another wide receiver on the trade block just to see if anybody wanted to bite. But overall, the team is pretty young. So... Uh, let's go ahead and advance the week, man. We'll see how, how things go. Uh, what are we trying to get for ODB? I mean, I might be better off just trading ODB straight up. Oh, he signed. He signed. Yeah, they all signed. Nice, dude. That's as good as I can get it. Um, so I got to scout these college boys. Let's do that real fast. Um, I'm just, I mean, I'm literally just going to sign. the. I have like a middle round pick this time. So I guess I'm going to do that. Uh, I forgot that I had a middle round pick because I got it from Miami. Uh, so I, uh, will just try to scout some guys, uh, that I haven't scouted yet that are earlier. And I have a lot of, uh, fourth round picks actually. So let me actually go down to the fourth round here and just scout up like every boy that's in the, in the fourth round. If I can ever get there, uh, strong safety. Sure. I don't really need one, but I will definitely scout them. It's a cornerback. And then we will go ahead and just move on to the next uh, week. Because I'm not even going to try to sign anybody else. I have who I want. So let me go ahead and advance week. And we'll see if anybody offered up anything for ODB. Probably not. He wants a billion dollars. All right. So we will do that. And uh, let's see here. We're going to go down to the fourth round again. Because that's where I have a lot of friends. So I'll do fourth and fifth round uh, scouting. So basically what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go through this. If I don't get an offer for ODB by the time the draft comes around, I'm going to take a quick break and I'm going to go through and try to just manually trade him for kind of whatever I can get because I don't really care what I get for him because I didn't really use him a lot. Um, I think Surehand, Surefy is good to um, try to, you know, try to be good. So trying to do this. Yeah, I'm actually getting a lot of people scout. Hey, yeah, you know what? A new tight end could never hurt. Oh, he's a second round guy, dude. I like it. All right, so let's go ahead and advance to the next week. Because I there's no other free agents I want to try to sign. Uh, oh, we finally got an offer for him. So let me go ahead and scout these guys real quick. The offer may not be what I want. So if the offer isn't what I want, I will definitely take a break and scout. Um, and, and try to do my own trade. At least try to get somebody I, even if i can just trade him for another wide receiver that isn't terrible i'm fine with that because i just want to replace him because he's old and he's going to be gone after this year anyways i'm not gonna i'm not gonna resign him at all and the contract he has is like 15 million dollars i don't know what the heck is going on so i'm just gonna basically scout through here and just keep scouting everybody all the way down i guess um just so i get some more because i have a lot of fourth round picks Oh, wow, it's a left end with second-round talent. Look at that stuff. What, what are we trying to get for him? What, what are we offering for ODB? Third, sixth, and seventh. They can, they can eat it. So let me go ahead and advance the week to the draft. All right, so there we are. Uh, let me go ahead and take a quick break. I'm going to see if I can try to manual trade ODB for somebody or for a draft pick or for something. And uh, so I'm going to go and look at that. And I will be right back to continue and do the draft. All right, everybody. I was able to trade Odell Beckham. I traded him to the Bills for a first-round pick in next year's draft because I already have two first-round picks this year, and then that will give me two first-round picks next year. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and see if there's anybody else I want to try to trade. 
and then I will be back to do the draft. All right, that was the only trade that I ended up doing, so let's go ahead and get the draft rolling and see who I get. Let's go ahead and pause it so the time isn't going down. Skip ahead. Next user pick. First round, number 14. I got this for doing something. Uh, let's see here. Who we got? Who would I scout? Who's available? Who's going to be the... Oh, that guy. Oh, he seems really good. Oh, I got this running back guy, too. Wow, I got some options. Let's see. Field general. He is strong. He has good throw power, good short accuracy, and good throw under pressure. I'm so, like, tempted to take him. Carrying juke move ball carrier vision. And I can also trade Nick Chubb at that point. This dude's fast. He's got stuff going for him. Man, I really... Oh, there's another quarterback down there. Oh, uh, man. There's a lot of options, dude. You know, I need, I got to back up running back, too. What do I want to do, guys? I don't know. Man, it's such a hard choice when you actually have, like, options. Um, You know, I'm not really sold on Hookland. And what's this guy trying to... Nelson Fitch. Um, he's as a late first rounder. I'm going to take this running back, man, I think. I, uh, I think I'm going to try to, uh, let's go. Let's just, let's, let's roll the freaking dice, dude. Do we get it? The Lions. There we go. He's a hidden trait. He's 25. I can even keep him in the back and let him run. I can split time with, uh, whatchamacallit, with Nick Chubb. Let's get in the draft. Next user pick. I was just sick of trying to the figure it out. So, all right, block. pick player. Who's it gonna be? Dun dun dun. Oh, QB number two is still down here. He has super good throw power. He has throw accuracy mid, and throw under pressure. I don't know. I got that guy for a while. What is this? Ooh, he's got uh, he's got first round talent in the second round. You know what? I need a left outside linebacker. So let's go ahead with this guy. Because I can flip him to left. Boom. The Texans All right, cool. Actually, Kasim is a little better. That's fine. I mean, he'll be he'll be there. All right, skip ahead and draft. Advance the next user pick. I'm going to stick with Hookland, man. I, I'm hoping he gets better. All right, let's see here. End of the second. Who am I going to get? This guy's still there, dude. Oh, my God. Can I? I mean, should I? I mean, come on. End of the second round. Psh, I need a backup QB anyway. Come on down, friend. Why is he still there? Wow. All right, man. I'll take it, dude. There we go. We'll, and we'll we'll compare notes with this guy later. Man, I'm feeling feeling good about my draft pick so far. The Browns are now All right, make my selection. Pick player. Oh, I was a little off. I was, it was a, it was a late second rounder I had there, but that's okay. Uh, two. So anybody here. Oh, middle linebacker. I could use another one of those. Oh, that's a first round talent. Man, that's a second round talent. He's he's a third round boy with first round talent? Oh, dude. Wow. I can always pull somebody back to middle linebacker, I guess. I mean, if he's a first round talent, I mean, come on, right? Early first round talent, too, on top of it. Boom. The he's the eighth overall player. Holy crap, friends. I got, ah, uh, and that was a weak spot for me. Let's get back in the draft. Evicts the next user pick. I can dig it, man. I, I feel good about this draft already. I was a little worried about my team, but now I feel better. So I've drafted some, a running back. I've drafted a, oh, there's a third round boy. Oh, it's a second round. There's a second round. First round talent in the fourth freaking round. Uh, so I will take him first. Give me that first round talent. Boom. Like it. All right. And then we'll, I have a lot of picks. And hopefully I can get some of these other guys. Man, dude, I feel really good about this. Holy crap. All right, let's go down. Uh, who are we going to get? Who's the next boy up on the shuffle, friend? Se Ooh. Oh, wow. It's a second round. All those other guys were gone in those few picks? Holy crap. 
But this is I need a left end, and this is second round talent. Boom, give it to me. 67. Holy why is everyone so trash? I don't know, man. Give me second round talent at a 67 overall. Oh my god, one three of the next four picks. So do I have anyone available that I uh scouted? Those guys were all trash. Sixth round, fifth. Does anybody have fourth round? Another running back that I that's all the guys I scouted. God dang it. Um I mean Does it hurt to draft another? What about what would I get if I if I trade it away? Because I'm gonna trade away like all the rest of these dang picks. Fourth, 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 fifth, fourth, fourth, fifth, fourth, fourth, fourth. Is anybody offering me anything? No one's offering me anything good. I'm going to draft the guy first and then trade it away. Because what will happen is that's the only guy that's going to be taken if I wait. So, um, where are you at, friend? We'll go to scouted. All right, there. There we go. Fourth round pick. That's fine. Took him a little early. That's fine. I can put him on the practice squad. I'm not opposed to that. Get him. Let him. Let him beef up for a couple years. Oh, God. We're trading this away. For sure. Now it'll be like nothing. Because that's what... Uh, 2023 fourth round pick. I mean, I'm just basically trading it for another pick next year. Is anybody offering me anything? They all want to give me picks, I guess. All right. That'll work. That's fine. I don't... Oh, that's two years away. Oh, I see the trickery you're trying to pull on my on my face. 2024. Oh, these guys. These guys are slick, dude. Let me tell you what. Um, but I'll I'll take it. I don't care. I see these guys jumping me two you two days back. Alright, man. So choose your pick. The Boom. We will uh trade away the pick again. Review offer. I'll be trading all the rest of these away, by the way, guys. So um uh, let's see here. Oh, I can dig that. That'll be fine. What Take another one. Before, the fourth round picks seem to be like Jones, flowing like freaking down. molasses. The Browns are now on the uh, we'll clock. trade it away. I got the guys I needed. Um, Fitz. Oh, you want to trade? Oh, there we go. There's a fourth boy. I guess that's all I'm getting. Um, oh, do you think so? And we got, oh, it's our fifth round pick. What are we, what are we getting the for this one? It's a big old fither. I don't really care. Boom. Let's Hold take it. Now. That's fine. Take it next year. All right. Man, it's next user pick. The Browns are now on the clock. We're on the clock, friends. Oh, fourth round pick for that? Absolutely. The That's because I don't care if it is right for the Steelers. I cannot believe I got a running back. A quarterback and two linebackers is some of my like biggest needs. So I I'm not taking anybody because I don't have anybody scouted, I guess. I guess I'm just trash like that. Uh this is a sixth round pick. So if we're getting a fifth, 137, we'll take that guy. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got a trade. Alright. Let's see here. Boom. The Browns are now on the clock. Just trading them all the way, man. We're loading it up. Oh, there's a fifth? Oh, wait. Hold on. No, you want to offer me a fifth, too? There we go. I, see I can dig it. That's cards. fine. You know what that means? We've got I know what it means. Please. The oh, my God. We have more picks. Clock. Holy crap. I had a, a gang load of picks. Uh, six. All right. There we go. Nope. Nope. Yep. Nope. Yep. Yep. What wait looks like both Oh, it looks like we're trading away all our picks. I think that means a trade is coming. I think it means the trade is coming too. And there's the pick. All right, let's grab any sort of sixth boy I can get. Boom. There we go. All right, now we're going to skip ahead, review our little picks here. Boom, a draft recap. Let's see. Who would we get? We actually didn't do too bad. We got a backup or maybe a potential quarterback. Yeah, that's nice. All right, I can dig it, man. Because even this boy, like even these two boys, like they can go on the power on the squad. They can, you know, we got some stuff. So we got a running back who is fast. 
Yeah, dude. Okay. All right. I can dig it, man. Don't you worry. All right. So let me see here. What I'm going to go ahead and do now is go ahead and tool with the roster a little bit. Get into the preseason. Get through that. Blah, blah, blah. And then uh, I'll be back to show you guys what the final roster looks like heading into season five after I've determined who is going to start, et cetera, et cetera. So I will be right back. And we are back. I am here ready to start season five, week one. Uh, real quick, I'm just going to go through the depth chart of the team and show us who is rolling with our season five guys. We have Nathan Hooklin. I'm going to roll with him again. Uh, I have this guy waiting in the wings if need be. So we'll try it out. Uh, we got Nick Chubb, and we got LaMichael Reed, uh, Justice Hill we just signed, and then this guy we've had for a couple years. Um, I think what I'm going to do is give uh, a formation to Reed, and just if anytime I run that formation, uh, so that way he can get better as the season goes on, and I can take have him take over next year. Uh, Trey Madden, of course. And then here we go. We got uh, Trent Sherfield, Quadri Henderson, Roy Harvey, Dylan the Villain. DJ Glenn and Markel Van Buren. Uh, not that great of receivers, but that middle three pack, Quadri, Harvey, and Mitchell. We'll see how they turn out. Got Butt still here. Good. And then our line, it's like we got 81 here, uh, 77, 83, 76, and 81. So they're not too terrible. My left end, 74. Eek. That's my rookie. We'll see. Hopefully he gets better. Uh, 74 on this side too. So my line is definitely not great because then here we got 80 and uh, 78. So my linebackers, we got the rookie. He's going to come in because Seam is still here. Uh, we got Mac Wilson and Todman and then Stackhouse there. Titus Foreman, 88. So I mean, we're, we're cruising along. Got 280 overall cornerback, 77, 73, 72. Not too terribly bad. Uh, I'm keeping Redwine as this guy's a free agent, so I didn't want to really lock in on him. So let, we'll let Redwine get better. Uh, James Hollis, I've had him for a few seasons now. Uh, our terrible kicker, uh, Corey, Corey Jorquez. And then, of course, our returner is going to be Rashawn Beckett. And then our punt returner also is Rashawn Beckett, that running back. And then our uh, slot wide receiver, Roy Harvey. So. All right, guys, uh, that's who the team's going to be. I'm going to go ahead and get uh, everything rounded up here. And that is all the time I have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the content we have here at The Crazy Down. If you've already done that, share your video with your friends, please. It will be greatly appreciated to get it out there to everyone else. But for Jonas, I will catch you at the beginning of Season 5. But for now, I am...